Hey everybody, it's Aaron with Mountain Bike Adventures. Right now I'm at the Angwin Bike Park. Nope, it's not a bike park, it's just Angwin. A lot of trails. And this is a new parking lot we're in. The kind of refer to it as the PUC parking lot. And we're gonna ride our bikes all the way down to Moore Creek. So I do have a really good guide with me today. His name is Jay with Bikes On. Howdy. So we are actually gonna be twinsies. We're both rocking Santa Cruz Mega Towers. Really excited to check this out because this last time I was in Angwin, I didn't have any clue on where to go. This will be a much better day. All right, so let's go ahead and get geared up and we'll go check it out. Okay. Forest trail sign here gives you a kind of map and overview of uh, the top, the topography of the place. And uh, if you want to donate or give back, you can contact uh, Peter, Peter Lacour and uh, he's on Pacific Indians College. Um, he's the, uh, let's see. well, he's the head force service manager here. Oh, okay. Uh, he has an Instagram too for uh, peace, he's forced. But yeah, it's a really beautiful thing. They just put this up within the last year, so. Very it's nice. cool to see this place grow. The fire that goes that way as well. And that's kind of the perimeter of this place. So you don't want to go any further that direction, which would be south. And uh, this whole place kind of runs north to south, so that's a good way to indicate where you are. Um, it is hard to tell sometimes where things are out here, but that's why I'm here. So I'm gonna show you. Jay is actually planning on being a mountain bike tour guide, is that correct? Absolutely, so if you want to book a tour, uh, I, you can do that through bikesom.com or um, it takes you to my friend's tour site and we pick people up from a hotel or from wherever you want, or if you have your own bike, you can set something else up. But basically, uh, we're just starting the business to, to get people that want to come out and do things other than food and wine and give them an uh, avenue to bike. Um, Some mountain bike. Forests here or, or wherever. So um, anything Napa Valley, um, I got and, you covered. And that's bikesum.com? Uh, yeah, that could take you right to the the tour page and it's a Napa native tour that my buddy does so he does all kinds of tours if you don't just want to do biking you do like kayaking or hiking oh cool anything you want to do uh Napa Valley related he's got you covered and you're you're in good hands with Jay so <laughs> if you want to come check it out in this area and you want a good tour guide make sure I'll be uh putting a link in the description below yeah, so PUC is actually free. Uh, this forest is um, not something you have to pay to uh, to come out and enjoy. So they already got jumps here. Yeah, so this is Dave's fun part. Oh, okay. Kind of just running through this first, just because it leads to the trails, or you can go around starting the fire roads. But I figure, why not? We're right here, so. Yeah, this will be cool. Jay could show you how to jump. I'll show you how not to jump. You don't have to come out and hit the big thunder. Holy crap. That's they have a 28 foot gap here. Definitely some stuff you can work up to. But my calculations, that was 28 and a half. You ever do come out here? He's got brooms. Nice. You can pick up a broom and sweep the trails a little bit, help out. Uh, little oh. bike rack here. Just kind of. You want to spend some time and relax they have a bench so it's just a, a great community and good people we have one here two three and these are just little options that kind of lead to the same trail that we came up uh, just to the side of it and we're gonna hit a couple of these just for fun um, there's nothing too big as far as jumps it's just more uh, berms and turns and stuff such cool uh, the main line here has all the jumps and it is rated with like double black so make sure you know what you're doing if you're coming out here um, try to look at things before you just start sending stuff. Yeah. Um, you don't want to hit one of those big 28 foot gaps. Yeah. <laughs> at least some of these jumps on the main line now are all tables. They used to be gaps, but now they have tables for people to kind of progress on. Oh, good. That's, um, that's what I need. And then, yeah, we'll kind of walk into it. But this is a dual slalom right here. So that would just start you um, at the top there. We can race each other if you want. Uh, this is the, the line that's just right of main line. And then it kind of takes you into some smaller jumps that have some tables too. This is just kind of a circle 
so it gets you warmed up before you drop into the lines. Okay. Uh, but yeah, we'll start on one here. I was sick. Kind of a bunny hop into the berm. Oh. I'm on a good record case, about 50, 60 percent at least. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, it's the climb doesn't seem real bad either. Yeah, it's just Simple, gets you right back to the top. And As I'm dying out of breath here, yeah. <laughs> climb's not so bad. Not bad. I think I've seen you ride this on one of your videos before. Yeah, I've done a few videos out here, actually, quite a few. So, probably where you kind of make sure your bike's all locked in and just this is a, a good testing ground to just kind of figure yourself and your bike out. But, um, like Dave is the owner creator kind of of this place he's put a lot of blood sweat and tears in here and uh it shows so i try to come out and at least do my part when i can and you know just sweep the trails off when they get really dusty um and you'll see him out here working a lot so he'll be vocal and he'll let you know like if they're working on something but well, people don't realize how much work goes yeah. into even something you know this doesn't seem very big but this is Yeah. Yep, yeah, that's the way a lot of these are, so. Yeah. But this here, I mean, even just this little loop thing, you know, little berms and stuff, a lot of hours could be put in this. Oh, yeah. Ready? I touched poison oak on my left leg. So that's one up here and then a log rat on the right. Oh, wow. I'll kind of just show you it. Oh! <laughs> Oh, <laughs> dang. 
beeline. It's got tabletops. I'm gonna roll through this one. Oh, that's big. Has got the. Hey, I got that one pretty good. I gotta there. send it. Oh my word! Yeah, nice little send. <laughs> oh, little. So this will be mainline. This will be mainline. All right. Mainline. We got several lines out here. Just come check it out. Yeah, these are still too long for me, but that's where I want to be, is hitting stuff that big. Yep, yeah, yeah, all right. Oh, I have no gear, blowing it. Is that part of it? Oh no, I think it went off the slalom. Dang it. Hey, that's a great jump. I took a wrong turn. <laughs> there it is. Hey, that dual slalom is cool. One more time. Two, one. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh man. Oh, I think I ended up in his lane. <laughs> Sick. Nice. All right, guys, thank you so much for checking out Mountain Biking Adventures. Since we played around in this bike park so much, I'm gonna make a separate video for this. And part two will basically be all the other parts of Angwin going all the way to Moore Creek. Appreciate you guys checking out the channel. Remember, make life an adventure, grab a mountain bike and ride. Pew.